Ooh. This is a long table. Look at this. And another soul. Ah! What the freak? Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, that actually freaked me. Yeah, I was definitely recording when I saw that. Alright, so I really don't understand what's going on with this thing. It keeps doing some very bizarre and strange things. You ever get that feeling when you're being watched even though you know you're alone? It's kind of giving me sort of like that vibe, and I'm not sure I kind of dig this thing. Ugh, what the heck? Listen, the show must go on. I got a video to make, and I want to get it done right now. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to another episode of Three yes! Random Games. It is that game series where we go ahead and play three random games from the internet, all within the confinements of this singular video. Now, uh, as a couple of you guys pointed out in the last episode, my forehead didn't expand. Now, I know that alone is why 88% of you guys even are still watching this series, so give it to them, okay? Yeah, this does hurt me, but you know what? Do it for the fans, all right? Do it for the fans. Now, are you guys down for another SpongeBob horror game? How about a comedic-based themed stalking game where you break into houses? What about the SCP universe? I mean, I can already hear the chair. I guess you guys are down. All right, this first game is called Mr. Crossy Requires the Souls of the Damn, bro. Now, this game is made by Dave Microwaves Games. This dude is formidable for making amazing cartoon horror crossovers, but I think this is more of his original series using the SpongeBob images. Well, I mean, kind of. Look at these dudes on the menu. <laughs> Listen, he wants them souls. Let's go ahead and give it to him, all right, guys? So, controls. We got that standard stuff. The story. Mr. Crossy has cursed your friends and plans on consuming your soul. Fortunately for Pat, uh, he discovered a way to lift the curse. If he can find and contain eight souls of the damned, he'll be able to satisfy Mr. Crutty's hunger and restore balance to the world. Let's get it. Sounds like a task for me, guys. Here we go. Collect eight souls of the damned. Yo, how about we just leave the exit? We're not smart, guys. We are not that smart. So we're collecting eight different souls. Let's get it. Yo, why does this feel so atmospheric, though? <laughs> uh. Baldy! Baldy! What, what the freak is that? No, dude, I'm going that way. Bro, you hear me? He went into like a locker or something? Right, let's go. So we're looking for eight different souls. And once we find them... Ooh. Whoa! Hey! Hold up, do you see that? So that was soul number one. Let's check the corners of this storage area, guys, you know? Take a good look around this place. My doubt is that I'm gonna find a soul number two. Hey, let's go. Soul number two... Hey, who the freak is... Bro, how do I hide from him? Hold up. Ooh, I think he's gone this way here. Listen, guys, I ain't down to see whatever's trying to get me, okay? Sounds like it's got a ruler, but highly doubt it. Let's go this way here. These endless hallways, bro. I don't know where they're leading me to. Ooh, desk lamp. More storage and another one of these. That's three out of eight. I mean, this is kind of easy, you know, guys? Three out of eight down. I haven't even seen the monster. Yes, I've heard him, but his presence can't even get close to me, you know? Give me that fourth one. Got doors here. We can't open those. Uh, how about in here? Uh, ooh, this is a long table. Look at this. And another soul. Ah! What the freak? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, what? Oh, oh my god! Bro, what the heck? Bro, I'm actually freaking out! Oh my god, run! Guys, that background music is freaky as heck, dude! Uh, please go away! Please! Please! Bro, so far, let's go! Okay, we're doing this! Dude, I don't know what's happening! This is actually freaking me out! A ladder, go, climb. What the? Dude, did he just. <laughs> He tried to trap me and just trapped himself. What a moron. All right, that actually freaked me. It's like they hear you talk, isn't it? Okay, that ambience is genuinely kind of scary, guys. It's really intense. Uh, oh boy. Let's start back at the beginning and try and work our way through. Uh, all right, soul number one. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Uh, hello? Is anyone there? I mean, I know you are- Oh, okay, that's what the sound is then when it closes, like, the jail cell doors. Uh -huh. I don't even know what that thing- Bro, is it here? What? Dude! Oh! What the- <laughs> Bro, I don't know what's happening or what's going on. So I assume that's, like, Squidward? Bro, what happened to you? This is literally Baldi's Basics and Krusty Krabs together. I hate this. All right, we're halfway anyway. I don't hear anyone nearby. All right, there should be one in the corner. Let's go. Okay, so if I go now the reverse way, there's only one other soul I don't know the location of. But once we find that... Oh! What the... Bro, back off, please. Please. We gotta give him the juke. We gotta give him the juke. Come on, bud. Let's go. 
Come on, SpongeBob. You think you're going to get me? Yeah, no chance, buddy. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, look at that. I don't like how he makes no sound. That's kind of terrifying. Here we go. Big open room. So we know where these ones are. Yep, six there. And then the seventh one is in this corner. But I don't know where the eighth is. That's the issue. Come on. Come on. Okay, we take that. Uh, bro, he still knows we're there. Oh, he is he getting quicker, though? Okay, let me run this way. Okay, uh, I'm going to go down this. Ah! What in front of behind? Why does it keep doing that? I hate this. I hate this so much. Come on, we're seven out of eight. Where could the last one be? I found every single one apart from my... You gotta move, bud. You have to move. Please. Don't make me go out like this. Come on, squid Oh, my... Oh, three. Oh, three. Oh, we got it. Exit effect. Where, though? Oh, no. SpongeBob's a quiet killer, guys. Oh, he's right there. Okay. That ain't good. So as long as I keep this dude like behind... Oh, no. Don't close me in. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, we might have a chance. Oh, God. Don't do it. Oh, my... No! Let me go! Let me go! I'll beat this game. I have to beat this game. There's no... Maybe he's gonna beat this game. I will beat this game. Okay, Dave Markowaves games. Yes. I'm committed. And I'll come out of the winner. Yeah, you know what? Shut up. You're not even scary. No. Okay. What? Bro, is he quicker than me at two? Okay. Did you just see me through a wall? Cheetah! Oh god, and he's coming too. That's just great, isn't it? Don't do it. No! Oh, come on, bro! No, 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 no! I would not go out like this! I think this is the exit, guys! Come on! Please! It is! Go! Yes! Holy crap! Oh my gosh! I got the same RNG when I got the eighth one and they were both very good! But I still did it. And I can't see anything right now. The normal ending. Using the souls of the damned, Patrick shoves them down Mr. Krizzy's throat, causing him to spaz out and release the souls of Patrick's friends. Balance has been restored, but this ending doesn't feel very entertaining enough for my taste. Try beating the game in Krizzy mode. I don't know if I'm down for that, guys. I got a feeling that's much more difficult. Okay, so this gave us a taster of what it would be like if SpongeBob SquarePants never became a TV show, but instead was the idea of Mr. Man, okay? He went ahead and made that with the mascots into Baldi's Basics. Yeah, I'm actually glad now that we got the TV show instead, okay? Oh my God. <laughs> You're doing this in the daytime, sir. One can hope this is only your property you're doing this in, okay? This is a game called A House of Thieves. It just sounds cool. Basically, the premise is this dude needs to go shopping and get some goods, so he goes ahead and writes the list out. And instead of going to the grocery store, which is always busy, and he can never get the things he wants, he takes it upon himself to break into people's houses and take the things that they got which he wanted. You know, people always say we play nothing but horror games in this series, so much so that it should nearly be called Three Random Horror Games. So I'm bringing it back with this one here, guys. I want to see what this is about. Let's go. Go ahead and steal some goods. And here we go. Press Q to see your list. Oh, we got pedestrians. Hey, sir, how's it going, man? How you doing, huh? How you, uh, how you guys doing? I sure hope when I pulled up here, I probably didn't look too suspect, though they probably... Dude, we got police posters already. Let me see my list. Hold on, so things to steal. Bread, coffee pot, diamond. Why do you want a diamond from a supermarket? Toothpaste, football, cheese on a plate, pizza size, mouthwash, and a toy train. What a varied list, you know? I appreciate this guy's taste in just about everything. Take a look around the back. You don't want the pink flamingo, though? Dang, dude. Wait, let's see. <gasps> we found a way in. Hello? The resident's home. It don't look like it. What's the time, guys? Now, some of you might be saying it's 10.24, but you know what time it actually is? I'm just steal the bull crap. Out of this place. Guys. Why we got a resident in the house? I'm about to smash this plant pot off his forehead. Hey, buddy. Who is going? Look at that pink hair. Yo, I like the style. I like that dude. Let's take a look in the fridge. Here we go. So, where's he got? Here we got beer. Uh, I don't need that. My man is deaf. This is perfect. Let me see the list. Hold on. What do I need? Coffee pot, cheese, pizza slice. Where's all the goods? I don't see nothing. Checking these real quick. Okay, let me just, uh, you know. Huh? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, huh? I just need food and you won't allow it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's just sit. Close the door. Ah, uh, I didn't close the door. Bro, he's on me. He will not leave me. Can I climb up here? Ah, uh, yeah, check the ladder. Dude, that was sick. He's coming for me. He's coming for me. I'll take this whilst I'm waiting. Ah, uh, toy train, toy train. Where's it? Bro, I'm climbing back out. Let's go. Ooh, we jump and dive. Look at that. Does he know I'm here still? I'm a bush. I'm a bush. I'm a human bush. It's not work, guys. Wait, has it? What the freak? What are you doing? Oh no, he sees me again. Yeah, guys, I'm from, don't be alarmed. We're just going for our, you know, jog around the house. Uh, where's your garage, dude? Guys, I'm going in. Let me in, let me in. Oh God, I'm stuck, guys, I'm a door. 
I'm literally a household object. It worked twice in a row. This dude's a moron. Oh, I hear him outside. Let's go. Oh, God, he's right there. Bro, I'm a toilet. I'm a toilet. I'm a toilet, literally. I'm, I'm literally the embodiment of a toilet, bro. You're basically touching your own crap. All right, let's take a look then. So we got a new resident. He's gone upstairs. Let's go, guys. Oh, his front door is locked up. Ooh, I see what's happening here then. So if he's upstairs, let's take a look and see what we can steal around the back here. Open the back door. Okay, I think the list remains the same. He leaves the diamond right by the back door. Fool. Listen, listen, listen. I hear him coming back. So let's go back outside. Hold up, guys. Take a look. I'm sure he's nearby. But me Oh, he was. He was. Oh, he don't see me. Let's go. Up the ladder. Yeah, that's it. Okay, toy train. Let me open the door. Let's take a look. Oh, he's got security cameras. So underneath we go. Close the door. Ooh, it doesn't pan, which is good. Let's take a look in here. Okay, we got that. I'll take that. You don't want a coin? Are you kidding? That's free cash, dude. I guess we'll be leaving that. Let's open this door here. Look at the tub. I appreciate the work. This is nice. We want toothpaste and mouthwash. There's the mouthwash. Now, we got to listen for him, guys. Hold up. Oh, there's some movement. Let's take a peek. Here we go. Here we go. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, we can hide? Oh, that's kind of cool. So if we see him come upstairs, we run down. I appreciate this game. But let's see. What's the residents up to? Because it sounds like he's standing still downstairs. He's moving. He might be coming upstairs. I don't know what these sounds are. They vary so much. I don't see him. Let's go. Let's go. We're going out, guys. So we need more things. I hear him. Hold on. Let's take some uh, chances here. We move. We move. He might be coming upstairs. Woo! He's there. Huh? Whoa! You know, you look right. You look right. Go, 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 go. I'm out. I'm out. I think we got away. I think. Maybe. Did we get away? Oh, no. He sees us. Yeah, what are you going to do, fella? the freak you gonna <laughs> what is he doing man i don't know i'm sure he doesn't either either way the man was scared not long ago and it seems like he's taking it easy now maybe he's going around the doors you know what we're gonna have to survey the land from outside guys i'm gonna wait for him to go upstairs and then we'll take our chances okay, there he goes look he runs he ran up oh please don't tell me he's patrolling by running also cop car here we go open this door here Take a look. We got a bathroom. Uh, did we want the paint? We don't. We don't. We don't. Let me see what else I want. Hand soap. Uh, you got hand soap. There it is. Coffee pot. Yep. Oh my god. I snitched that. I could have slapped that dude around the back of the head and he wouldn't have realized. What else do we need, guys? Tomato and a football. Is the football outside maybe somewhere? Oh, that would have been nice. Dang. So I don't know where that is. I don't know if I should risk this truly. Let me see where he is. Don't see him down here. I think he might be upstairs. Okay, he's in the bathroom. I see his hand. I see his hand. See, please don't see me. Please don't come this way. <sighs> turns back, turns back. So he's not going to retrace his steps. All right, guys, let's follow where he goes and go the reverse way. I literally have lost him. I don't know where he went. He's in there. Okay, let's go. We need a tomato. We desperately need a tomato. Where's your tomatoes at, sir? Oh! We got caught. Donut, let's go. Okay, we're getting some more things, guys. We're back in this thing. Give me the mouthwash. Oh, I know what I want when I came to this place. So we need three things. Game console, uh, the football, and the tomato. Which I can't find the tomato anywhere. Is he upstairs? It's hard to tell, though. Open these game <laughs> console. Oh, he's there, he's there. Okay, so we check a balls and we get out. Let's go. Can you not just be satisfied and get the tomato and the soccer ball from somewhere else? He sets bear traps in his own home, guys. This is the type of soccer ball. Where's the tomato? This dude is probably going to put a tomato in one of these drawers, right? This seems like a weird guy. You could literally steal a tomato from a farmer's yard that grows thousands and you wouldn't realize. Do you seriously need one tomato that bad, dude? Why not leave? Guys, nice. I've searched his whole kitchen. There's no tomato. He doesn't like tomatoes. Oh, God. Is it in here? <gasps> no, that's an apple. He saw me. He saw me. He saw me. I gotta run. I gotta go. I gotta go. I don't know where this tomato is, guys, whatsoever. Whoa, he broke out of his room. Okay, we're up. We're up. I'm running back in. Okay, we gotta find this tomorrow. Let's look upstairs. We've also got some time. He doesn't hide it in the drawers. He sees me again. He always sees me, dude. Always. I'm down. I'm down. Do we seriously need a tomato that badly? Like, can we just not get out? Wow, man. He is a determined guy. Like, once he writes that list, he makes no exceptions. He has to get everything. There it is. I have it. I have everything. Why was the tomato left on a shelf, though? Why? Why would he leave the tomato? On a shelf when he has literally a fridge empty. I'm having a dilemma. I'm having a complete crisis over this game. 
We stole from the strangest man's house. Plunder completed. We got one star. We did that in four minutes, 42. But you know what, guys? We escaped with the goods we needed. Instead of going to the shopping center, we went to someone else's. I think that's pretty much it for this game. This is a demo, and the full thing does release on Steam soon. But it's a cool premise. It's got a real nice art style. And it is actually kind of fun to break into people's houses. What? It has a decent level of ways that things can go right and also wrong. So I do actually think this game is pretty cool. But we're going to leave this one here. How about we go check out an SCP? All right, guys, this game here then is called Cargo. It's an SCP-inspired game, and based on the way these guys are all lined up in the same uniform, it seems like we're looking at a military bunch. Let's go. New game, that good stuff. What disaster went down in the cargo, huh? Attention to all personnel. Hey, Proceed let's to evacuate. Go. An S-class uh, object has escaped from containment. Move to the nearest sector. Stay in until an all-clear announcement is made by the Cargo Special Operations. Are you hearing Thank this you music? for your time. Lady. You have just announced that literally something extremely dangerous has broken out and we get elevator music and here we go cargo uh <laughs> <laughs> For a situation that's pretty dire. I think this man's taking it kind of chill officer stand up come on your feet Okay, or don't that's also an order. Hey, here we go. You're the new one, right? Don't worry This kind of crap happens all the time. Okay. Well, that doesn't exactly reassure me. What are you looking at asshole? Dang, bro. I'm trying to be friendly. I guess I won't even be friendly This might literally be the last time you see me, you know don't even care. Let's check out this breach then, guys. So a class S. Hey, sir, how's it going? Let's talk. Go left. There is an elevator. There is a lot to clean down there. And this is our job. We are the cleanup unit. Or apparently just us alone. Let's go, guys. We call the elevator. Let's get this mess started. Here we go. We went down the... Oh, that don't look good. Guys, what happened then? Sir, are you okay? Strange. He has a class C infection. But that wasn't what killed him. Okay, do you guys know? You know, I heard from a friend of mine that there is another company like us. Some problems, you know, containment leak, scientists dying. He also told me that they had once caught some kind of gigantic peanut thing. Crazy. Yeah, hopefully you only know him as that too, because that dude, he ain't good. All right, All right, rookie. Do you see that black thing at the bottom there? All we have to do is get rid of them. Wait, what, where? Just get close to them, press the right mouse button to aim and the left mouse button to fire. Don't touch them because they infect you. And that's not covered by insurance. Oh, now we can aim. Hey, this thing here? Woo, we're popping this thing. Let's go. Yeah, you go back to the devs, buddy. You go back to the devs. What about this thing? This dude has a PDA or something? Apparently, we can't read that all the same. All right, let's go. Oh, this place is not pretty, though. There's so much of the infection. Get the heck out of here, man. Let's check the other way. We clean this up. There is no other way. Cargo coming through. Coming through. Oh, yeah. Back down, sir. Ooh, there's a lot here. Look at all these infections. Get out of here, man. I guess that's it for the fun. All right. Hey, new kid, good job removing those things. Go down and continue cleaning. Let's go. We do our job, we work our ways down the layers. You see that door seal up behind us? Excuse me? The Was that you? Oh, not anymore. Was it you? Are you infected? Problem taken care of. Dude, for the most part, like, we can clean this up kind of easily, uh, but I don't get it, because these things aren't even trying to get us. They're just kind of like stationary masses. All we do is this, and our job is done. Kind of fun getting to pop the rifle in a place like this, though, guys, you know? Oh. Hold up. These things don't bleed red, though. So now I'm a bit concerned. What the freak was that? Ah. Uh, okay, this game just got... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what this reminds me of? You know Metal Gear Solid 1? If you guys know with the ninja sequence, you know. Oh, dang. Look, he became fused with the wall. Uh, so... What on earth is going on? Why is this SCP? Around the corner, around the corner. Oh, I don't like this level. Come on, dude, come in! Of course, the lower we get, we get no signal down here. We should have really invested in better radios, guys. Let's keep going, let's keep going. Oof, this ain't good. Look at this. Physically lifted off the ground and impaled. Another PDA of which we can't read again. All right, let's move, let's move. All units, we need backup. It's sector nine. You hear the gunfire. Radio, repeat, we need backup. Where's sector nine? Is that here? We might be going to sector nine, guys. Let's go. Uh... I think the only thing that got cleaned up was my unit! Buddy, be careful. TV's fuzzing up. Uh-oh. Oh, this is kind of cool. I love the cutscenes with this game. This is cool. Oh, God. Oh, my. It's like Siren Head, but TV. He's using him to see? Uh, you got a rifle. Break the TV screen. It gives me control. Woo! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Is it working? I'm popping that thing. It ain't working, let's go! Let's go! Woo! Oh god! Get out of here, get out of here! Holy crap, guys, that's a- Oh! Bro, be 
gotta beat this thing. Let's go. Do we run away? I don't know. Okay, get rid of that thing. Let's go. We gotta move. We gotta move. Woo! This thing's quick, though. It's very quick. Holy crap. What about if we run around them instead? I don't think standing there to shoot this thing is a good idea. Okay, we gotta clear this one. Let's go. Oh, it's. I'm just running, guys. I ain't even looking back. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. We can dodge this. Go. Yeah, yeah. Good, good, good. Oh, he's still quite far back. I just stay up started running, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Woo! Go around that one. Oh, yeah. I see the exit. Oh, he's close. Let's go. We made it. Press the elevator button, man. Don't just stand there and look at it. You know what to do. Oh, the elevator does first. <sighs> Breathe, fella. Breathe. Okay, and the static changes. We escaped, though. Let's go. Dang, that was an oddly tense game. Very short, very little story. It just kind of threw you in the depths of it. And that's all it needed to do. So now my question is, what about that class S though? It's clearly escaped and we couldn't contain it. It's gonna take over whatever world this is. Well, those three games were certainly very interesting. We got Baldy, if it was SpongeBob. We got Supermarket Man that doesn't shop at supermarkets. We have SCP which is named Cargo. These are three really fun games though, all the same guys. And if you do want to check these out for yourself, you can check the link down below. But for this episode guys, this is where I'm going to leave it. And I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. So thank you so much for watching this video guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy. And I will of course see you on the next one.